Hey, I'm back. Yeah, the party was fun, but it was way too crowded. I wish you could have come. Did you get any work done while I was gone? Oh, well that's good. It's kind of ridiculous that they gave you a deadline on New Year's Eve, though. Who does that? <laughs> No, I know it's important. I just wish that you didn't have to work so hard. Did you finally submit it to your evil boss overlord? <laughs> fine, fine. I mean, perfectly reasonable boss who would never ask too much of his wonderful employees. Except that they work on New Year's Eve, which is completely unfair. What? What? No. I did... I didn't say anything. Alright, alright. I'll tell you. You're brilliant at your job, and I'm glad that you love it. But... It was still wrong of them to make you work tonight. If you're not gonna call them on it, I will. <laughs> Besides... I know you wanted to go to the party with me tonight. <laughs> no, no, don't lie. I saw how disappointed you were when I left. I know that you love New Year's Eve. <laughs> you practically blew out my eardrum counting down last year. <laughs> no, don't worry. I didn't want to hear anyway. <laughs> Honest, I really like seeing how excited you get. <laughs> Why do you think I came back tonight? What? Yeah, it was worth it. I didn't even want to go to that party in the first place. You were the one who insists that I go. And have a good time and blah blah blah. I went. People were <laughs> loud and drunk and... I hated it. There. I completed your ill-advised request. Now, will you finally believe me when I say that I'd rather spend the night with you? Good. I'm holding you to that. Now, stop gluing yourself to that computer and come watch the ball drop with me. <laughs> come on. You know you want to watch. If you're tired of it, we, we don't even have to watch the ball. The Times Square celebration is overrated. No, we can watch some other place. All the small towns drop way more interesting stuff. Guess what Beavertown, Pennsylvania drops? No, it's a platypus. Really? I promise I'm not lying. What? No. <laughs> no, don't look it up. Uh, because reasons? Well, the main reason is because they really drop a beaver, but <laughs> that's not important. No, I don't think they drop a live beaver. <laughs> At least, I hope they don't drop a live beaver. <laughs> Maybe they do. Maybe it's like that short story, The Lottery. They randomly select one of the beavers from the nature to serve as a tribute. And his death brings peace and happiness to all the other beavers. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. See, look, they use a stuffed beaver. No real beavers will be harmed in the making of this New Year's celebration. <laughs> anyway, you've got plenty of other options. Um, there's somewhere in North Carolina that drops a pirate. Presumably it's not a real pirate. Okay, I'm slightly concerned that you were more upset about the beaver falling to its death than the pirate. 
I know they made too many pirate movies, but I'm not sure that's the fault of actual pirates. Look, they're just dishonest people trying to make a dishonest living. Don't judge them. Fine. If you really want dropping a pirate to be the new walking the plank, I, I guess I can settle. <laughs> it's nice to see you laugh, finally. Yeah, we can just watch the ball drop. You're such a traditionalist. Let me turn it on. See? Just in time. Everybody's gathered in the Times Square. Ugh. Why are those New Year's Eve glasses still a thing? I know they have them every year, but we've been out of the double zeros for a while now. Who wants to awkwardly watch the ball drop through a pair of 2,020-something frames? Okay, okay, I'll stop. I'll just let you enjoy the moment. It does only happen once a year. <clears throat> okay, are you ready to count down? Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! Yay, we made it through another one. Here's to us. What? Um, yeah, people normally kiss at midnight. Well, yeah, that, that is the tradition. Um, uh, well, I wonder how that got started. I wonder what it is about the New Year's Eve that screams, kiss somebody. You don't really see it happen with other holidays. I guess maybe Valentine's Day, but even then, there's not an exact moment for kissing. It's really only this one holiday. Well, maybe also Christmas because of mistletoe. But that's also not a specifically timed event. Um, yeah, uh, what, what exactly were you asking? Oh, uh, you want to, um, no, no, I, I wasn't trying to imply that I wouldn't like to kiss you, I just, uh, I didn't want to assume that you wanted to be kissed. Um, w <laughs> wait, I, I've wanted to kiss you for... A really long time, actually. I mean, don't get me wrong. I wanted to spend tonight with you regardless. You're one of my best friends, and nothing would ever change that. But I look at you sometimes, and <laughs> it's hard not to want more than friendship. But I only want that if it's what you want, too. Don't feel any pressure or anything. What? W well, yeah, I guess you did literally just ask me to kiss you. Uh, I just couldn't believe it. Uh, that, that was real, right? <laughs> oh, good. Um, this, this is what you want? Uh, okay. Is now uh, a good time? Perfect. <laughs> You're so cute when you smile. Well, yeah, I'm happy too. How could I not be? <laughs> You're amazing. Although, now you have to admit that you were wrong for trying to send me to that party tonight, don't you? What? What do you mean you sent me so our friends could finally talk me into asking you out? You're such a sneak. No, no, I'm, I'm not actually mad. I'm glad it worked. <laughs> very, very glad it worked. 
well, sort of worked, I guess. I think you still technically asked me. <laughs> hey, if it makes you feel any better, five different people have sent me kissing gifts in the past hour, so it's not like they didn't try. <laughs> we can update them all tomorrow, I'm sure they'll be thrilled. Especially whichever ones had New Year's Eve in the betting pool. <laughs> it's our friends, of course they had a betting pool. Oh, don't worry about them. Tonight, it's our turn to celebrate. We still have three time zones worth of New Year's Eve ahead of us. There are so many more things that we can watch drop. <laughs> Let's see, Mobile Alabama drops a 600 pound moon pie? Hmm, some place I can't pronounce literally just drops a giant dead fish. <laughs> no, of course we don't have to watch any of those. We can do whatever you want. I just hope that you think that me kissing you every hour on the hour is a good idea. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, no, that wasn't meant to be a limit. We can kiss as much as you want. Happy New Year. <laughs>